<laughs> what are we doing with tampons? <laughs> I was like, tampons? It's a little rocket. <laughs> <laughs> So, how do tampons work? Uh, <laughs> <you> can, uh, <laughs> <shit>. <laughs> oh, I see. Okay, I know what's happening here. You put it inside, you push it, then you take the plastic out. Incredible. And it's gonna be kind of in here, and then you you grab this and you fish it out, right? <gasps> wait, wait, you said it in the most unappetizing way possible. Wait, was it supposed to be appetizing? <laughs> Ab appetizing. Let's start over. <laughs> it soaks up the blood. There you go. It doesn't make a mess. Yeah. Or if you got a bloody nose, you learn. I've learned this from a movie somewhere. Yeah. You should have your nose. Walrus mode. <laughs> Let's go, regular so, boys. <laughs> so when would you? Why would you use a regular versus a light or a super? My understanding is it's based on the flow. I actually keep tampons at my apartment for women when they come over, just in case. How many tampons do you think a woman uses in their lifetime? Oh my god. In a lifetime? Oh, oh that's god. a lot. <laughs> For a person, it's got to be tens of thousands of dollars. Yeah. Is yeah. that your final guess? Like ten thousand dollars? That feels like a low. That feels like a low guess, but yeah. I'd say probably like seven thousand dollars in their lifetime. Twenty-five thousand. I'm gonna go with fifty. Fifty thousand. Yeah. Fifteen k. Twenty k. Yeah, I was gonna say. I was also gonna say twenty k. So according to the National Organization for Women, the average woman spends about twenty dollars on feminine hygiene products per cycle, adding up to about eighteen thousand over her lifetime. We all burn. Yes. yes. Eighteen thousand dollars. Us. Close that is an investment. Eighteen thousand dollars in the life. Oh wow! <laughs> yeah, you're welcome, bro. Okay. Like I said, I bought them. <laughs> what could you buy with eighteen thousand dollars? A base model Challenger. <laughs> could buy a few motorcycles. Yeah. Today you are going to guess the price of being a woman. Oh, okay. great. <laughs> That's expensive to be a woman. That sounds. It, it is. <laughs> It's not protection, is it? <laughs> mm -mm. It's, it's <laughs> you know, I don't know much about it. It's not used. It's brand what new. Is, what is this indent here? <laughs> My original yeah. thought was like a nipple thing, but it's not. I don't think. <laughs> I have no what idea. What do you think this is? <laughs> Makeup. I I do. I have honestly I have maybe for the nipples for <laughs> breastfeeding. <laughs> Oh, that actually. I'm, not, I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. It's a cup, right? A menstrual cup? Yeah. So it's an alternative to tampons or having a pad. It's like Killer. the Captain America birth control. <laughs> it's just a shield. <laughs> you put this in, and then this is to take it out. Yeah. So this is the, this is the, the finger hole. It collects mm. uh, wow. the uh, stuff that falls out, and it then collects. you go to the bathroom, and then you you dump it, and then you. Like, What's the it. stuff that falls out? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> your uterine lining. <laughs> Oh my god, are you cleaning that out? That's a messy situation. Yeah, that's, that sounds like a very uh, messy situation. But yeah, it goes. Finger groove. Before inserting, ensure there are sit, squat, or raise one leg. Should we try this? <laughs> With what? <laughs> I actually never learned about this in health class. Having a like, wonderful, I didn't um, even have health class. Oh my god, same. Yeah. Catholic schools don't teach you that. Simple? If this works for you, you should buy yourself a motorcycle. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so how much do you think this menstrual disc costs? Forty dollars. I'm gonna go thirty-four ninety-nine. Uh, <laughs> I mean, it's just it's medical. I say medical twenty-five. Grade, it's medical 25, grade silicone. Twenty-five. Okay. I'm gonna go with twenty. Unknown Twenty-two ninety-five. No, I'm gonna go right under twenty-one seventy-five. I'm gonna say this is fifty dollars. I'd say thirty. Thirty. It is thirty-nine dollars. Thirty-nine dollars. Oh, 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 this is expensive. Oh, uh, hot diggity! I almost said fifty. I We're, think this is a great alternative as it's reusable. Yeah. It saves you money. It pr probably depends on what's comfortable. Yeah. I would be. I think I'm going. If I were to, no, I can't. I'm not going to choose what I would use. That's dumb. <laughs> I don't know what that's like. <laughs> My question is, what is that? <laughs> it's a little cup. Oh. Don't don't ew. Uh, Ugh. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. The more we play with it, the more I'm freaking out. It looks like it has the same function as the last one, but there's something else going on here, and I don't know what that is. Yeah, it almost feels like a breast pump, right? Like a that you attach to it, but I don't think that's the case. It's got milliliters on it, and the tube could attach to this part to like go into the pump that you squeeze. It's looking very nipply. What happened in The Last of Us? Uh, Ellie was given one of these when they arrived in Wyoming. Yes. Oh, that's right. Uh, it's for your menstrual cycle. <laughs> it's not a shot glass? Well, <laughs> for Dracula maybe. Good one. Thank you. This is a diva cup. 
Okay. It yeah. is for your period. It is not for your nipples. What? <laughs> How many period things are there? I, mean, I honestly didn't really get why there was measurements, but maybe it's just to be excited or be like, look how much I oh have. Oh my god, <laughs> I this yeah. much today. So you and your friends can compare. <laughs> oh. That's a technique right That's there. The technique. You are way too... You know exactly what to do with all of these. I love women. What can I say? <laughs> As an economical, eco-friendly, leak-free way to experience total period comfort. Leak-free? You wouldn't know it by the way it's constructed. All right, so how much do you think this costs? Maybe 35? I'm gonna go cheaper. I'm gonna go like 15 bucks. Mm. 30. Actually, no, I'm changing. 45, 95. I'm gonna play it safe and say just 39, I guess. I'm gonna be bolder. I'm gonna say... 35, actually, sorry. I'm gonna say $45. I've guessed first. Okay, I'm gonna sorry. say... 29.99. I'm gonna go down a little bit. I'm gonna go with 50. The Diva Cup costs $33.77. Oh, oh, I was closer this time. 33.77! Oh, Damn! Affordable Diva Cup! <laughs> I might switch over. <laughs> <laughs> it is $33. Oh, I was cents. almost right the first time. I said yeah. 35 yeah. Oh, well. That makes sense. You know, I should I should have guessed that it was slightly cheaper because it feels slightly, like, less high quality than Ooh, the... Yeah. Like, the rubber doesn't feel as, like... Ooh. How much does a uh, typical haircut cost you? It can be anywhere from $25 to $50. Okay. My guy used to do $18, bro. It was my boy. Mm -hmm. He raised the price up to 20 and then because of COVID-25, he gets the other people paying him 30, I pay him 25. Mm. Yeah, so like 65 if, to 100. 65 to 100. Unless you go to like a super cuts, which is like 20 something bucks, but I never go to a super cuts. I was gonna say, you don't look like you go to super no, cuts. No, I do not go to super cuts. <laughs> no offense to super cuts. Um, <laughs> LA is expensive. I would say probably $60. That's even expensive. Is that expensive? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> I've not gotten my hair colored. I would imagine that would run you an extra $40, $50. I think that's like 100 bucks. We're gonna watch a video of a girl who just got her hair done and we're gonna guess how much her hair cut costs. Oh. I'm really happy I was brave and did it and I promised you guys I would tell you about the cost. So, um... So what, it, what her, are we seeing here? Her she, intake of breath. <laughs> I like the color, but I don't feel like he did that great of a job on her haircut. It's a little weird. I don't know, maybe she's got it combed weird. That's an interesting style. Yeah, like the way she has it style looks kind of weird. <laughs> Cut, get in the trim. Let's just say 35. Make it make it just a normal 35, because it doesn't seem like much. But then you got the color. 25 bucks for a box. You get that at like a supermarket. You do that yourself. But she got it professionally done, so. I would say 100 to 120 dollars. Okay. I feel like she spent like 200 bucks on this. 250. 250. No. Okay. I'm gonna say 450. 100, give or take 20 bucks. All right, Benison. So I'm going. Su I'm going way higher than that. I'm going like 240 dollars. Mm, let's say 220. You said 220. I don't know what I said. <laughs> I'm gonna say. <laughs> Price is wrong. 200. <laughs> it was 380 dollars, and then I gave a 70 dollar tip, which I hope is okay. Golly. I was, was kind of close. What the? Dude, no. More than that, dude. I'm telling you. No. No, she, no, 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 wait, she bought, she bought blow dryers! No, 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 that doesn't count! Wait, you didn't have a blow dryer before? Well, you saw her haircut, I'm not sure. <laughs> <That's true. laughs> That's a year of haircuts for me. <laughs> Average women's haircuts range from $35 to $150, depending on where you are, and then color is on average $65 to $200. Does that adjust for the fact that they have more hair? It's an average for the country, though, right? Yeah. yeah. The but what's ridiculous giving. to me is, like, I used to have long hair, like, mm. down to here. Oh, wow. Oh. And they would still charge me immense, like, men's prices. Dude, women have it bad, man. I, I how much did you pay for your hair? It was a little around over $300. Right. Yeah, 300 is no! around, around, around right. I wouldn't be let back in the house if I went out and spent that much money on a haircut. <laughs> <laughs> I'd be disowned. <laughs> what, by your family? Yes. How much oh. do you guys spend on skincare? I don't have skincare. Uh, I spray a my face. bit. Rice polish? Dude. Only the good stuff. Cleansing oil. The essence. These are very confusing labels. Yeah. How am I supposed to get into this? Why do you think women spend more money on skincare products than men? Because they're more beautiful. <laughs> Duh! How much do you think this little skincare kit costs? 60 bucks. If I knew the brand, I could tell you, but it's I'd say... It's a good brand. It's a good brand, like 150. Ooh. I'm gonna stick with $60. You're gonna go 60, $60. Julian? I'll go 90. 60. Yeah, I'm going uh 55. I would say 60. 65. It is 74 dollars. 74. Yeah. You can get all of this for 74 dollars. Yeah, I'm not exactly trusting it. So. <laughs> 74 dollars. Oh! oh, I was gonna say 70. Wow. That looks like yogurt, and I want to eat it. 
What about undergarments? What undergarments do you wear? What what kind of question is that to ask a man? <laughs> <laughs> I'm so offended. Um, <laughs> I do not spend much on undergarments in the I least, but I don't even go. Oh yeah, Ross's would be a good price to go out or Amazon, get like a five pack. Ooh. I feel like they're your size. Yeah, I mean this is perfect. What size do you think it is? C. C? Maybe a D. No, that's a that's a is it over a D. Actually, yeah, it's a D. Yeah, that's over a D. For <laughs> Once sure. we got the no way dimension. that's a C. She is a thirty-eight D. Wait, how did you know that? I read the tag. Oh, <laughs> yeah. oh. killing it. So cute. Oh, Christmas card. According to the New York Times, this is the most comfortable bra on the market. It's, like it's it? very soft and also it's I got... I think there's extra padding on the bottom to lift it. <laughs> so I gotta come around this way. We're making out here. We're making sweet love. Okay, yeah. Just... Can we get it? I got one. Okay. You got one? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh my goodness. <laughs> it's <done>. Bam. <laughs> I'm so used to taking them off that I'm not used to feeling it, you know? Like, oh! This is nice fabric. Yeah, I was like, the fabric yeah, is like, the material nice. feels like it's really like, everything soft, but the, it's nice, but like, the scratchy. The, the little scratchy part here, like, it looks like, like you said, like some, na like <laughs> some nipple poor. shaping. How much do you think a bra like this costs? Oh, bras are expensive. I'm gonna say this is 50. 42. I'm locking at 60. Locking in? I'm gonna go 47. I'm gonna say 45. They say it's the most comfortable bra most comfortable on the market, so I'm gonna say 65. 80 bucks. What do you think, Travis? I'd have to agree with him. <gasps> Don't compromise for quality. It is $72. Oh, it's close. Pretty close. $72! Oh, I should've gone to 70! 72! Oh. Damn, that's expensive, bro. Yeah. Wow. I mean, there's a lot of it, but there's not, there's not that <laughs> there's much of it. There's a lot of it. Is it based on the cup size, though, too? Like, more material? Like, mm. I guess I didn't factor in enough about it being the most comfortable bra on the market. All right, let's go on to the next one. Hey, throw me that bra. <laughs> oh, it's giving for rotisserie chicken, not gonna lie. <laughs> it's like Spanx, right? Mm hmm Yeah. Exactly. For a small woman, there's no... Like, this it looks is... like this is for a child. The fact that this presumably fits a full-grown woman. <laughs> I think it does. Look how much it stretches. What? Yeah, what do you think of that material? <laughs> What's wrong? I the butt the cheeks? Armpit. I thought it was the armpit. Oi, oi. I thought that was no. the armpit. I was not paying attention. It fits on me. That is But it's wild. really hard. <laughs> it's not a baby gymnast. They make these for men now. I, I've never tried one on or seen one at a store, but on, on the Instagram I see ads for the... This is where he has the knowledge now. Do you know the company Skims? Oh, this is Kim Kardashian's situation? Mm. Oh yeah, my girl has been trying to get Skims for a minute. What would be like a good tagline for this product? Uh, we promise you can get it on. It's <laughs> <laughs> pretty good, honestly. Look how small that is. It really stretches that much. Just oh, material. it covers the side. I see. Do you know how much it costs? I don't actually, okay. but I'm gonna assume it's probably like eighty bucks. I was gonna say ninety. Actually. Yeah. Okay. One hundred and seventy-five dollars. <laughs> <laughs> um, he said one seventy. I'm gonna go with. Uh, I'm gonna go two hundred. Eighty-five. Ninety. Probably like hundred, hundred twenty. That's my guess. Is it more? Oh my god. Is it like is it $500? <laughs> is it five hundred dollars? Is it five hundred? Is it two hundred dollars? It is sixty-two dollars. Okay, oh, that's actually okay. much cheaper. Than I oh, yes. we were worried. Yeah, we're after the three hundred and eighty dollar fucking haircut. <laughs> Still I was expensive. thinking because it all oh, because when you're saying Kardashians, I think yeah. it's gonna be expensive. Me too. Well, I had the you know it's the Kardashians. Right. So. No. Affordable. Oh. No. There's, There's a hole. hole in it? <laughs> Oh, that's news. I've never related to anything more in my life. That's like men's underwear. Yeah. <laughs> hey, let's talk about sex. <laughs> yes! <laughs> <laughs> if you want to have sex, I'll do it. Antifungal? Oh, no yeast. What guy doing that to you? What guy? Shit is, what? Bro. What's that? Vaginal antifungal. Oh, another Last of Us reference. <laughs> 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 is this for a yeast infection? I've seen a lot of monocyte commercials, so at least this one makes sense. I haven't seen very many menstrual cup commercials. Maybe sure. that's why I think everything's a douche. I didn't know yeast uh, <laughs> infections were fungal. Yeast infections, bro. Vaginal ointment, man. <laughs> what do you know about yeast infections? Uh, they hurt and are really, really uncomfortable, and they have to may happen more often than you think. <laughs> <laughs> that's true. Well, I'm gonna guess that you put ointment around the applicator and then shove it up you. Okay. But gently. Gently. I mean, yeast infections are no fun from what I just... <laughs> it is it's, open already, sorry. It's a marker? 
You know, it's like an expo marker. I'm gonna sound so uneducated. You only get one. Do you not need more than one to cure? <laughs> According to the Mayo Clinic, yeast infections are caused by antibiotic use. Mm. Like literally just okay. women taking antibiotics can totally throw oh, off pH levels. That. Thank God they have a treatment that's one day treatment. Yeah, I'm like literally just like reading <laughs> all the God. things on here. I'm gonna but. say $30. Yeah, I'll 31. Let's play that game. Oh. <laughs> I'm gonna ballpark it at $45. I hope it's not more than 20 bucks. I'm thinking 45. Right. Yeah, I'm thinking 29.99. 25 dollars. Okay. It's like 14.99. Okay. It is 24.79. Oh, oh so close. 24.79. Oh. oh. <laughs> Let's go. Not, 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 uh, breaking the bank. It could it could be cheaper. It could be cheaper. Look, are you just holding these with I such... Know, really yeah, good. sorry. I don't know. No, I love it. Here. <laughs> I feel like we're doing a PSA about yeast infections right now. <laughs> oh, yeah. I know what this is. <laughs> <laughs> it's a COVID test. <laughs> Pregnancy test? Yeah. Okay, great. <laughs> that was wrong. I was like, wait. Uh, no, you did great. How do you use this product? Pee on it. Mm -hmm. Pee on it. Almost like a COVID test. Like, like for your vagina. <laughs> you know you can play you, you can play Doom on one of these things. You can, Wait, what? You know you the game Doom? I can't play Doom on that. Someone's done it. You take the thing off and you pee on it and then you wait a little bit. Yeah. yeah. And then if you're me, you uh, cry tears of relief in the Safeway parking lot uh, and <laughs> you share a muffin with your girlfriend. <laughs> <laughs> wow, they're always like wrapped individually. Nice. It's got an extra technology flood guard. I flood guard like technology. Like $20. I'm gonna go with 30. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna say $12. 12. I'll say I'll say 25 bucks. See, I bought them and I don't even remember yeah. how much they cost. <laughs> it's because the price doesn't matter at that point. You're like, I just have to know. <laughs> just give me that sh But I think it's like 20 bucks. Okay. Yeah. Travis? Yeah. 20 bucks. You go first. You go Dude, first. Dude, I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go 30 bucks. That's what I was gonna say. I'm going 32. 1999. Woo! I don't know why we're tapping every time. Not too bad. Yeah, yeah. to find out you've maybe created life. life. Yeah. Oops. This is the yeah. cheapest part of that. Yeah. Right? Well, it is 20 bucks. That's what I thought. 1999. Okay. Ooh, one right on the money. I feel like it goes both ways. I'm sure women buy it more just because they probably are they, more. They're the ones using it. Like, Oh sh! I gotta like figure this out. Yeah. But I can see men paying for it, making sure like, hey, like, let's make sure this isn't a thing. Like, let's mm -hmm. or is a thing. Or right? is a thing. Or is right. a thing. Yeah. It always goes, we, I keep thinking crazy. He's like, no. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Babies are dope. You know. <laughs> ah. Oh yo! I've never seen it in person. Uh, yeah. <laughs> really? Yeah. yeah I've thankfully, heard about it. Thankfully, haven't had to use this. I have gone with someone to buy it. Yes. But they, but they were scared to go on their own, so I went with them. <laughs> It's sixty-five dollars. <laughs> <laughs> so he already knows the price. <laughs> Wait, does it say it on there? Nope. No. <laughs> You're certain. <laughs> he, he already knows. And it's electronically protected, bro. You walk out of there, beep, 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 beep. First okay. of all, sorry <laughs> to all of you who have ever had to take this. This thing absolutely destroys you on the inside. I can only be sorry. I have nothing else to offer. So according to Planned Parenthood, a morning after pill like Plan B One Step can lower your chances of getting pregnant by 75 to 89 oh, percent if you take it within three days after unprotected sex. You have three. And these types of morning after pills may not work if you weigh more than 165 pounds, oh. which is another Isn't it issue. Isn't similar to birth control in general, though? I think they all have similar weight weight requirements. Yeah, and if you have health insurance or Medicaid, there's a good chance you can get Plan B for free. Um, you just have to ask your nurse or doctor for a prescription, so your health insurance will cover them. Even though you don't actually need to, you can buy this in stores. Yeah, and not live in the wrong state. Wait a second. Asking your doc... What are the chances you get a doctor's appointment in those three days? That's the problem. Wow, I didn't even think about that. Sixty dollars. Having never bought it, I'm gonna go with that. The uh, last time I I saw it bought, it was like sixty to sixty five bucks. Mm. Everything costs cheaper than I expect. Like I'm gonna go thirty bucks on this. Thirty, okay. See, I'm thinking this is like a big thing that you're like, yeah. Oh, sh this is a bad. This is a bad time. I'm going fifty. Fifty. I'm going fifty. Okay. I'm gonna say fifty. It is forty nine ninety nine. Wow! Oh, right there, it's right gone right down in it. price. <laughs> <laughs> $49.99! Whoa, whoa, on the dot, on the money, bro. Mm, on well the done. Money. So the cost may be uh, not affected by inflation. <laughs> maybe. I don't know. So much Have you money? seen the stat on how much a baby costs a year? No. It's like $300,000. You can buy a baby. <laughs> no. <laughs> 
You have to rent it. It's a yearly <laughs> cost. A year, yeah. yeah. What did you learn about the price of being a woman today? Expensive. It's expensive. It's way too expensive. <laughs> <laughs> Make sure your boyfriend splits the price of the pregnancy test. Yes! <laughs> we gotta fix this. We gotta fix this. We gotta bro. fix this. Put All these right. tampons in these women, like now. Like, <laughs> what? Like, like now, pronto, man. This is, this is not good. <laughs> it's a very big conversation and it's gonna take time, which sucks. Yeah. Because women have to pay the price in the meantime, which is not fair. There's so many hard things about being a girl.